grabbing coffee with Kelly this morning. He's back in town. Good morning! Wow, my hair is so long. I'm actually gonna get a haircut today, so that was totally staged. <laughs> I, mean, I need one too. You wanna come with me? No, I wanna go get my own. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> one time I took Kelly to a Korean barber, actually the one I'm going to today. He came out looking like Korean. I got a firm. So I'm gonna go get a haircut in a bit, actually right after this. I actually have a surprise for you and everyone else later tonight. Are you excited? No, I don't know what it is. How can I be excited? <laughs> it's a surprise. You should be excited because it's a surprise. Oh, it's a surprise! Nope, your surprise in the past have been terrible. Billboard was not good. <laughs> <laughs> I have a few things I need to do before I get to the surprise later tonight. I gotta go run some errands, get a haircut, do some stuff, do, do the transition. Watch. <sighs> you guys know how the other day I was raving about how warm it is here in New York? Okay, well yesterday night it actually snowed. <laughs> yeah, maybe not as warm as I thought, but it is warming up a little bit. I feel the spring energy there. And when it gets warm, uh, my mood is up. So, oop, I almost got run over by a car. <laughs> Haircut is done. Jacob always crushes it. I always get my hair cut by him. He actually hooked it up today. He was like, it's on me. He didn't tell me to say this or anything, but if you're in New York and you need a haircut, I'll link this up. Hey, nice haircut. <laughs> Thank you. I'm hungry. Wanna eat? Let's go eat. You wanna see my hairy ass? What the fuck? <laughs> you wanna get food? Yeah, I can dig you up some of my shit. <laughs> Dude, that's my jacket. <laughs> Like that? Freaking wedgie? Gotcha! <laughs> this is a realistic depiction of how Kelly acts around me. Meanwhile, you just walked into me naked, you bully. He made fun of my hairy butt. I didn't say anything about your hairy butt, although it is hairy. Hairy as hell, man. It's your words, not mine. I wanna see it? No, sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh! That hit perfectly. Let's go. So slow. All the time Bro, waiting on them. Are you kidding me? God, I'm so fucking hungry. God, you're so fucking annoying. Go fucking die. Whoa. Oh my god. Can we cancel this bitch? <laughs> yeah. Cancel me, bitch. Dude, you, you're not acting cool. Dude, I'm cool. You think it's cool because you swear like a little bitch? You're a little bitch. <laughs> bitch. That's you. Hungry beef whore. <laughs> what does that even mean? The amount of times that Elliot has gotten me to pay for his food by just asking me to hold it <laughs> is actually ridiculous. Bro, I have never done that. I've always paid when we come. I can confidently say I've uh, never I done have, that. I have a video clip of it. You say, thank you, mama, but that happens every time. Can you hold this for me, Elliot? What? What is this? Oh, we should check out. We should check out. <laughs> Dude, I did not do that. Not today. Thank you, Mama. I didn't even ask you to buy it for me, but you were just holding it, so. <laughs> Got some food. We are headed to the WeWork. Feels like the summer days when I used to frequent the WeWorks. Emery actually ended up paying for it somehow. I, I promise it wasn't intentional, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> it's getting warmer out here. Dude. No one vibes with you. <laughs> <laughs> bleh. Excuse me. We're trying to get everyone to do a bleh for the camera. Bleh. Bleh. Yeah. Nice. What's up? All right, everyone with me now. Bleh. 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 Had a very solid work session at the WeWork. Got my daily vlog up. What is this? Is that a building? What is that? That looks so weird. Okay, anyways, I'm headed to a meeting right now, but I wanted to fill you guys in real quick on what we're doing later today. I have been talking to this guy named Ryan Surhan. He's a real estate agent here in New York City. You might've seen some of his videos. And he got me access to this apartment. It's like a penthouse in Brooklyn, but it's like a $10 million penthouse. And it's like the craziest thing ever. He is giving me access and I'm gonna take the roommates over to that apartment later tonight. And yeah, we're gonna spend the night at this $10 million apartment 
literally I think Zendaya owns an apartment in that same building it's crazy I haven't seen it in person yet so I'm equally excited to just check it out I think it'll be good I think the roommates they're gonna enjoy a little taste of luxury what's up dude how are you I got a package. I didn't think this one was coming today, but it was in my elevator. I'm actually very excited about this one. Ooh, these look sick. These are, what are these? Nike Dunk High Retro? I don't know. It's nothing crazy, but I saw one of my friends wearing it and I was like, I need it. Oh, kind of tight. I like them, but they might be a little bit small on me. I don't know if I'm supposed to break them in. Also, my meeting was great. I think there's so many talented, driven people in here in New York. And for me, my biggest priority in my 20s is actually just to learn as much as possible. So meeting really smart people who are working on cool things is something I actually really like to do. Some people will tell you that you should just say no to most people if they're interested in meeting up with you or taking some of your time for a conversation. I personally think that it can be really worth it. I believe in like investing in people, building relationships, that stuff takes time. And yes, of course, prioritize yourself, but if you can afford to make time to meet with other people, have great conversations, it really works out in your mind a little bit, gets you thinking about things, and actually can give you a lot of energy. All right, it is currently 4.51, getting ready to head out here in a bit. I asked my friends to come to the apartment so we can leave from here. Again, none of my friends know where we're going, so I'm very excited. Oh, I didn't know you. Hey, hey, can you help me? Take some Instagram photos. You look terrible. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Just clean. Wait, why is this elevator not moving? Dude, Wait. you're stuck. No. Dude, no. We're stuck in the elevator right now. Wait, is it even moving? No, it's not moving. I'm trying to open the door. Dude, we're literally stuck. Dude, no way. Dude, I gotta pee. <laughs> you can't make this shit up. We're stuck, man. <laughs> Do we try to open the doors? Do you think we're on the first floor? Oh, where are we? Oh, we're like halfway up. You see that? Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. This is really being stuck. Dude, should we call someone? Click the call, push this the one. call. Ooh. Hi, I, th I think we're stuck in the elevator. What's your name, sir? Elliot? <laughs> Dude, you're gonna make it worse and we're gonna fall down to the basement. Look how close it is. The walls are caving in. You are a little bit claustrophobic. No, I'm not really claustrophobic in this. That doesn't make me claustrophobic, it makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> I need to call out the love of my life. Ashley! Ashley! I'm stuck in the elevator! Are you, are you serious? We're stuck! Good luck! Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Did you get a haircut, Elliot? Yeah, I got a haircut. That's all that you care about? Not that I'm dying and you don't want to say something? If you die, just know, like, I really like you. <laughs> I'll be there in an hour and a half, elevator mechanic. <laughs> it's crazy long. Dude, what the fuck? Dude, we're gonna miss my surprise. No. Yes, my head hurts. Dude, Dude I can't last an hour and a half with you in the elevator. I'm gonna have to pee. You should just pee into your own mouth. Or just go in the corner. Oh no, it's gonna smell. Dude, I'm gonna pee out the chute. Help us! What if we died? Like living, like this is just heaven. <laughs> <laughs> this is heaven. <laughs> this is heaven. This is hell. This is heaven. I know this is a, a desperate situation for us, but don't say it. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? We are the last two people no. in this elevator. For the sake of the human race, we should probably reproduce. <laughs> It's not even possible, man. Anything is possible if you set your mind to it, Kelly. No limiting beliefs in this elevator. Oh, my head hurts. The air's getting thin, oh, dude. The air's dude, getting thin. Stop breathing so much. You're wasting oxygen. Stop it. Stop it. I can't believe he said an hour and a half. Like, I'm gonna pee in here. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> dude, you cannot pee in our fucking elevator. I'm gonna pee through that hole right there. Dude, it's not gonna fit. Help! We're stuck! I hope no one fucks me. <laughs> I put on my Instagram what we should do to pass the time. Let's see what they say. Dude, the first three things I see. Make out, talk about your feelings, <laughs> have sex. <laughs> oh. 
It's been one hour. We're still in the elevator. I am starting to go a little woozy woozy doozy doozy. My head is spinning a bit. I think I'm dehydrated. It's really dry in here. There's no oxygen. Kelly's doing push-ups. He's using up too much of the oxygen. I'm not gonna die. Weak. Do some dips. This is a prison workout. <laughs> I learned this in prison. Yeah. Dude, we should make this a workout. That way we can be efficient with our time. Take advantage of every scenario. I'm gonna run some laps. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh my god, my head hurts. Oh god. My head dude. actually hurts. <gasps> dude. Oh. Ah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> oh. Rescue. Thank you so much. Woo! Wow, it's dark outside. No way, it's dark outside. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you. You Have saved our one. lives. Have a good one. Thank, thank you. you. You're welcome, guys. I just saved your life. Wow, your life. I owe you my <laughs> life, Nick. I'm gonna take the elevator. I don't wanna walk the stairs. Get in there, get in there. Where do you think we're going, Kelly? Sperm bank. Uh, okay, <laughs> Anne Marie? Uh, a movie theater. Nick? You're taking us to space. Holy crap, no way. Dude, Elliot. that was Nick. Nick said that, not me. I didn't say that. Wait. Elliot, stop. What? No way. Dude, I'm not taking you to space. Are we gonna go in an elevator again? <laughs> <laughs> I don't wanna go. Another one. The world's longest elevator ride. Dude, I can't. I just was in it. Buckle up. Come with me. So we are going to a $10 million penthouse. Oh, wow. Up there. What? No. What? And Zendaya lives in this building. No. Actually. Oh. Yeah. Zendaya from Euphoria? Oh. I love her. <laughs> We're spending the night here. Wait, who lives there? No one? We live there for tonight. What are we gonna wow. do up there? We can do whatever we want. Oh my god. Oh, I'm turning on the lights. This is an insane view. What the fuck? This is insane. Look at this kitchen. Look at this kitchen. Oh. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? The bedrooms, Sony bedrooms, look at this room. Like, what is going on? I'm TV Cribs, come on in. Wow. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Mm, god. <laughs> come to the kitchen. Oh, this is for the kids. Oh, oh that's this is for the baby? Oh, that's bigger than my bed. Oh, this living room. That's Wait, sick. What the heck? Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Oh my god, look at this view. Oh, yeah. Look at this bathtub. Oh, look at Oh my god. Yeah, the view looks better with the lights on. Oh my god, this bathroom is insane. The ground is cool. Oh, look at the view, look at the view. You can just watch the game with a city view. Put on two no, wait, actually? Yeah, this one is that one. Oh. Oh. What if we just absolutely graffitied the hell out of it and destroyed it? <laughs> I think you probably have to buy it or something. You think? Well, we got here, right here. The couch with the large scarf. Large scarf. <laughs> That's a blanket, no? No, it's a scarf. Now, this is the horns. The, the horns? building of the horns. Uh-huh. Roo, roo. <laughs> <laughs>